Hey everyone, welcome back to the Game Joe with Dark PB1. Today we're going to be playing some Kirby 64. Kirby and the Crystal Shard 64. Uh, so, what I'm thinking is, we wing this and just see if this is fun or not. Because it's been a while since I played some Kirby. Look at that, look at that little bastard one. Ooh, eaten. Alright. Okay, that didn't work. I, I don't remember the control. I know you can take the power out and then throw it, and then once you throw it, you can, can uh, combine it with other moves. Fire drawing, yeah? Huh? Oh, sword. Kirby ain't playing around today. What a spike in the ring, guys. Okay, that, that makes sense. I think we're gonna go with Fire Boomerang. Sword action going. You know what? I want boomerang. I want boomerang. Yeah, I'll take boomerang. And then we're gonna go get uh go get frosty and boomerang. This game is so much fun. Is, is the ice guy in this level? I thought the ice guy showed up in the first level. Oh, that guy doesn't even have any power. Just like Mario. Oh, you can't touch those? Get her ninja stars? That's pretty good. That's not probably mad at see? That foresight. <laughs> it's so legit. Alright, I think I know where we're going. Yo, throwing stars only. Happy. Is that our new friend? We have to fight him as a boss now, right? I should be dubbing over this. Maybe I'll go back and editing and dub over this. Probably not. Though. Yo, OP much? Look at this. Oh, dude, we don't give up on fudge. The tea bags aren't very. Oh, alright, now there we go. Yeah. And you're super smart, tea bag, but it's a tea bag nonetheless. We did it! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Bye, Waddle Waddle is the best character in Kirby. Yeah, look, we made friends. Alright. 
Boom, got that one up. I don't know if the one up was the best thing there, but I know what a one up does. I didn't know what any of the other stuff did. I don't remember what the ice bomb does. I'm pretty sure it's not very good, though. Bro, OP much. Now that, all right, I'm I'm a call right now. We're gonna beat the game with just these ninja stars. Yo, OP. Anything other than the ninja stars is to get through hidden areas, but yeah. See, I want to save the uh, boomerang for the ice guy here. I knew he was coming up early on. I think every time you collect enough stars, you get a new life. I didn't know there was a, a fly limit in this game. I mean, that makes sense. It is 3D. Sort of. Well, that'll be... Yeah, I'm about to go sniping. I really, I really, I don't think there's a shard down there. You think, you guys think there's a shard down there? I don't think there is. <laughs> yeah, that's so broken. Who's this, the painter? Yeah, painter. Very waddle dee painter than King Deed Dee. So that means the uh, King Deed Dee stage is next. Yo. No means no painter, okay? All you had to do was say no and you would have been fine. Painter is OP. So you think. Fortunately for me, I am more okay. The stick doesn't work in this game. You have to play with it. Uh, the D pad. That's so. Oh man, that's dirty, bro. Better be salty, I'm overpowered. What is that supposed to do? Bro, I need to worry. <laughs> That's awesome. I'm not gonna lie, this game is, uh, classic. 
thing about this game and uh, the difference between this game and Mario Maker is I don't have to really edit this because for the most part it's just right into the next level and it's not like I'm going to lose every five minutes like some game. Mario Maker is very unforgiving with the uh, murders. Uh, I don't know what that is, but I wanted it. What is it? Fine, don't tell me what it is. That's fine. We're just gonna go beat King D real quick. I think it has bomb powers. They're just like Mario Maker. I thought it was gonna fall. Like, it'd be one thing, it'd be one thing, if it was- Like I was saying, it'd be one thing if this thing was just like a, like a fast throwing thing, like you throw it fast and then boom, and then it has like a delay after you throw it. But this thing's just straight up unlimited range, instant speed, and then you can just keep, you can just, look, 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 for days. You just can't direct it, it's just kind of sad. Let's see if we can get one of these guys. Ah, I think there's a snow. I mean, like, if you want some easy, easy content right there, that's some easy content. Maximum tomato, thank you. Yo, that snipe! Yo, the triple snipe, what?! Yo, not gonna lie, that was actually pretty snipey. I got that, that dude in the forehead. You guys gotta keep the secrets everywhere. I mean, I didn't really think that, but still. Could have been, could have been like one of the blue stars. That's what we really want, is blue stars. See, the thing about this is, like, we definitely could hit this. Like, we could destroy it. We have boomerang power, but we just can't aim at it. Yeah, we're killing it on lives. Let's see if we can beat the game with 99 lives. Classic, easy shot. Now, my favorite thing about this one is... It, yeah, it curves. It curves in this area. We, if we had just like tossed this and stole that, we could have went back and we were in the, uh, the spot. But we would need something to mix with it. Uh, I don't think the sword would work either in that situation, so I don't know. Is that what fire and boomerang does the sword, right? Uh, we're not going up here, but there might be a good stop up here. Going on, but I'm pretty sure there was a uh, secret up one of these. It's either this one or there isn't one. Yeah, I don't think there's a secret. I don't know why I thought there was. So far, we're only at 14, 15 minutes. We're at a 15 minute run time so far. So, that means we could probably beat the whole world. Maybe that's what we'll do. We'll beat a world per video. I mean, as the stages go on and get longer and harder, <laughs> longer and harder, as the stages go on and get more difficult, uh, 
the videos might end up not being as long, or they might end up being longer, or I'll have to do like half the world per, per video. Really just depends, I guess. We're gonna destroy the, uh. Well, we're gonna destroy him first. Look at that. Bro. OP. That's not even fair. <laughs> Just straight bumping on them, bro. Yo, they're just like... Peace out. Oh yeah, because a lot of these are like... Servants to King Dude, because he's the king. Or something. He's a little more like... I don't know. He's different. Should we go for the red star? I don't know what we want. I don't really think we need the one up. I don't... Okay, let's see what that does. Okay, it's just a bigger, bigger gold star. Alright, boss battle. So this will be the last uh, stage of the video, and then we'll uh, progress onward. I, I literally... Really, I should have been two seconds of that. Let's watch the cutscene and then we'll, uh, we'll call an end to this video. Meteor World. Yo, this stuff always got me hyped as a kid. I would be like, oh, look at these cutscenes. They're so cool. Then Kingdom Hearts happened and I was like, cutscenes? I hate cutscenes. Because <laughs> they're so long. Alright, everyone. This has been the Game Joe at Dark PB1. Uh, I rebranded to just the game Joe. The with Dark PB1 has been removed from the name, but it's still with Dark PB1 because, you know, don't kill what ain't broken. It's just the name was too long, so I decided to shorten it a bit. Other than that, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell to stay up to date on my videos. Uh and uh comment. Comment a lot. I want I want to see your comments what you think of this video. So uh peace out.